What up, what up, what up? Thank you guys for joining in today. I am VK, back with another banger, another banging video for you. Some information, some music. Hope you guys are enjoying. Still in the in the Griselda Records mode. Still, still on that vibe. That vibe is just is undeniably my cloth. You know what I mean? It's undeniably my cloth, to say the least. Still on that vibe. So I appreciate y'all banging with me, vibing with me throughout <laughs> throughout this display. Cause you know, I just love that music. That kind of that kind of music. And I feel good. I feel good when I when I when I'm in that zone. And I also just feel good that that kind of music is making its way back. It's peeking its, it's peeking its nose. It's peeking its nose out the blinds. It's like, they ready yet? Yeah, you know I mean, it's, it's making its way back. So I absolutely appreciate the energy. I appreciate that energy. You feel me? So with that being said, I got a sample. Uh, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with it as yet but you're gonna cook a pie cook up you feel me boom this is a sample right here Then he still I think I'm just gonna take that take this right here All right, boom, I got that. I need to count these bars real quick. Hold on. So I had to clean up the loop a little bit. I had too much on the, on the tail and I thought it was eight bars and I really chopped off. I, I really cut 12 bars. So I had to make it an eight bar loop. So now I'm, I'm in the mindset of, do I want to loop it or do I want to chop it? The loop don't sound bad. Loop don't sound bad, but you know, I, I like chopping, so don't hurt to test it out. So I think I'm gonna do is I'm going to I'm gonna loop it to catch the vibe and then I'm going to revisit and chop it. I bet. So I got that. Now I'm going to look for some drums real quick. I don't know where I'm going to find these drums at, but I'm going to dig in these folders. Hold up. So I got these drums. I'm not sure. Never sure if it's going to work. Never sure until you, you're sure. Right? But um, I got these joints, these drums. And I'm about to put it in a patch phrase loop. and uh, see what it do. 
See, I can just. can't just you know play it out but I'm gonna do the passphrase loop go back to the one new program I was speeding 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 and I messed up. I'm getting ready to layer my own drums. And I got these two drums, kicks, some bass drums. And I like the both of them. I like how it sounds when I when I hit both pads. So what I'm what I'm about to do is I'm about to shift and click the drum. So now Now I got both those drums on on one pad and I can flatten the pad. What I'm gonna do, <clears throat> I'm gonna bring the levels down. Oh look, nah, I knew I was doing something wrong. I got them, I got the both of them on the same thing. So what you can do instead of dragging and dropping it, you can just go to the second the second sample layer and select the actual sound that you want there it go so i was hitting it i'm like i don't hear the the high so what you do is you just bring the level down on this added a snare but what I also did was I added a, the air transient and I added the little attack some more attack less sustain Thinking about adding the um adding a reverb directly to this. All right, I'm gonna record this uh kick and snare pattern. What I'm going to do with the snare, I'm going to pull it forward. I'm going to sh shift it to the left. Nudge it to the left. Well, what I do is 
I basically hold down shift and on my keyboard, I tap. I tap the left arrow. As you can see, it's moving. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna copy this sequence. Sequence dos. All right, so I pulled up the mini grant <clears throat> from, uh, you know, Air Plugins. All 
I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna play that along with what I got. All right, boom, got that. Look for some sort of bass, some. Um. So I found this firm saw octave and uh in bass line, and it's in the thump firm saw octave. Super simple. Trying not to keep it basic. Shout out to CMP. Nah, 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 nah. So I like that. at halftime. But um, that's pretty much it, man. Yeah, yeah, man. That is pretty much it. Only thing left to do is put an actual proper mix, put it in song mode, sequence it out. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys learned something. It'll all be put together at this point in the video. If this is your first time here and you made it this far. I appreciate you. Thanks for banging with me today. Please do thumb it up. I'm not sure if I was in the Griselda pocket. That piano kind of threw it off. You know, I lost I lost my train of thought throughout the process. It's all about sounds. Not so much the sound design. Sound design takes a part, but it's more so sound selection. Like, 
what drums to layer under the sample then if you're gonna go the VST route remember that VSTs are clean or cleaner than actual vinyl or pulling from a sample so you gotta dirty up the VST a little bit to blend with the sample and it's all about you it's just utilities it's what's on what's in your utility belt right so that is pretty much it do remember that music is life it is our dna keep banging peace love and light till next time peace Peace. <laughs> Love it, y'all. Thank you. Okay, bangers.